Hi everybody, this is Devan Gogoi and technical analysis of Alice Flu. So this video I'll discuss about the crude oil, right? So I think you remember in my previous video, uh, I think uh, market was here somewhere. I given two uh, buy opportunity, right? Uh, buy entry point, right? So I told uh, if you again you can see uh, last my previous video. So I told that if you break this level of this past first 15 minute uh, candlestick right so that was so i told if price break this level so you can go for buy and the target will be somewhere here right uh four one six seven i given that target in my previous video and another i told that here is a supporting line exactly sir we can see 4053 so why i place this supporting line and here was a resistant line somewhere worse right so and i told the moving average uh the price will follow a moving average right now we can see here after that the price not able to break this higher point and just a retrace toward the supporting line right that was a support in line. Exactly at that time, we have seen horizontal supporting line, which is placing by connecting previous resistance line, and we have seen a candlestick pattern here, and we are getting a perfect buy order here, right? So I told when price will retrace, you can go for buy again here. Two buy option are there one by above when they will cross this uh, 15 minute and next if they are not able to break this level and when price will retrace toward this supporting line and you can enter for the buy right so after that you can see here our target are exactly are there right now uh, next day you can see price just uh, bouncing from moving average 20 right similarly here and i given next the resistance was around two to uh, six right two to six that was so after that price again fell down now we can see here we have seen a price action method right price action method they are creating lower low right lower low so now creating lower high so let's check it uh, what is that trading strategy where is our entry point and exit point today right for that one you can we have to find out uh the daily chart pattern so now we can see so i told that if they break this resistance line so definitely it might go up right so now we can see we have seen this resistance line was there very strong resistance line and it, today price just uh, open below this resistance line right and previous day candlestick pattern you can see this is a pin bar they are forming remember if the price close below this area right price close this below this area if suppose they form like that right closing point here so that is high probability to fail the price from this area to they will create a new lower low right so now question is that what is our trading strategy where we can enter today right so that is the most important thing right so for entry buy and sell uh for the buy and sell you can see here let me remove this one and let me put here lower points that is our yesterday lower point have you seen 4120 and we have seen a range 4167 so we will trade after breaking this level and target will be somewhere here around 4053 uh, right so let's check in a four hour time frame so four hour we have seen a candlestick clear candlestick pattern here so you can say like that uh, some people are say uh, this is called engulfing but i'm not recognized as an engulfing for becoming an engulfing the candle should be uh, engulf by entire candle right by this candle so here you can see this is small candle 
uh, uh, forming inside this uh, large candle right but here we have seen the little more personal aha uh, uh, portions uh, just outside from this candle right so that is why I never say this one engulfing but this is called one black crow so finally i am using that word right one black crow and every day i am explaining what is the meaning of one black crow right so we have seen this is a one black crow candlestick pattern right so now what is our trading strategy once they break this candlestick pattern this is called candlestick pattern one black crow candlestick pattern where is the lower point here is somewhere lower point right so i draw a line here the level is 4120 right for the sell remember for the sell the price should break this lower point or otherwise we never gonna enter for the sell right in between this area we never enter remember what is the level that is called no traded zone the no traded zone is 4120 you try to control your emotion most of the people uh, they never uh, like uh, they are not able to control their emotion and entering anywhere right that is called uh, that is psychology called fear of missing out right fear of missing out that means the people are thinking if i'm not entering right now i will miss the opportunity don't do that you know 90 percent people are losing only because of psychology not a garden not trading study not position setting only because of psychology so that is why try to control your psychology the psychology uh, how you'll control your psychology question is that the answer is you have to develop a trading system right the cell what is the meaning of trading system question is arising one by one right trading system is a specific rule of entry and exit now what is the specific rule of entry and exit the specific rule of entry and exit is there right let me show you sell below this supporting line that is the specific rule because if price not able to break this level i'm not going to uh, i'm not going for sell because that is my specific rule because we have seen this is a candlestick pattern they are forming if the break this candlestick pattern that is our entry rule that is the specific rule so when you have a trading system specific rule then you can control your psychology that is the most important remember right so uh, now we have seen for the cell so that is the most important thing right for the cell and for the buy you can go for buy here but you might you must place uh, a sell right actually our buy and is above this candlestick pattern but uh, that is for conservative uh, trader conservative who don't try to loss or they are looking for high probability trade right they people they never trade in between these range because why you know this is a candlestick pattern zone in between this candlestick pattern zone we never enter any direction right so we are always looking for break this level most of the people are thinking uh, we have heard about that uh, trend line breakout and um, moving average breakout like that etc etc not exactly most important thing candlestick pattern breakout right candlestick pattern breakout remember so now you can see we have seen this a uh, hammer pattern we cannot enter here right so we have to wait uh, to break this uh, hammer pattern have you seen so we are always placing buy order and the sell order below this area so this uh, entire candle that is called no traded zone so similarly we have seen this is called no traded zone right but some professional trader or you can say like that uh, still trend is going up right in a small time and so we can go for buy right but the sell we never gonna sell in this area so we will sell below this area right and remember there must uh, uh, some resistance should be there so we have seen some resistance so we can go for sell below this area for the buy you can say uh, we can go for buy above this uh, resistance level line because the trend is up right that is why 
So let's check in a small time frame like uh, so 15 minutes for our anti and exit, right? So we have seen now the trend is running uh, like in an uptrend and they're creating higher high and higher low, right? Continuous. So now we can see uh, we have seen this is a raise 10 line. So suppose they break this raise 10 line, here is a lower point, and definitely you can go for buy, but you can you must close your position in this area right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching